Sue, Catwoman in the comics. I have a theory about what they're setting up, and I don't think I'm going to like it if I'm right. Short version, Catwoman's in jail for some fucking crime or whatever because she feels really guilty. And her friend Eiko Hasegawa has taken her place, blah, blah, blah. You know, what was that, the fifth season or seventh season of Arrow? You know? And it's weird, because I get where a lot of people are coming from, where they want Catwoman to be separate from Batman, be her own character. Yes, 100%. But I'd like that more, and they they just have different jobs and friends sort of way. It feels like they're just kind of forcing the two apart, kind of, at this point, to the point where it just feels like they're not really allowing themselves to be happy, and Catwoman being with Valmont just feels like kind of the easy way out, especially since that dude clearly sucked. Like, seriously, am I supposed to feel sad that Valmont died? No, he sucked. He's the discount ghost maker. Come on now. Eh, I don't know. It's nice to see Shoes again, who for some reason still hasn't reunited with Red Arrow. What is going on there? Why is she a teenager, even? Wasn't she, like, ten years younger than Tim Drake when she died? Now she's about, like, only a few years younger than him? Very odd. Eh, I sent um, time travel nonsense. <sighs> Long story short, Catwoman 50, 3 out of 5, like a 7 out of 10. Not the worst thing I've read, but... I don't know.